This is Nassau Lions basketball. I'm the voice of Nassau Community College, 90.3 WHPC. Its score is 10-10. Uh, Nassau and Suffolk are tied with 12.46 left to go in the half. We have Malise Johnson looking for an inbound. Finds Andre Harris, who kicks it back to Darius Townsend, who then finds Kevin Roberts. Again, close to the half point line. They have about 20 seconds on the shot clock, so no rush there. Andre Harris is found, who shoots the three and just rims out. Rebounded by uh, number 24, Yancey Ulesi, who was a big performer for them last week off the bench. Yeah, 21 to 12 was a huge performance for them last week. Looking Dana for him to get it again. Dana King finds a shot on the, on the far side corner and hits it for two, so the Lions are up by two. Number 13, Darius Townsend, finding number one, Andre Harris, in the near side corner. Uh, goes for the layup. Looks like he was blocked, and he's going to get the and one. Foul by uh, Yusuf Young with the block. So he's going to get the and one opportunity now to make it a three-point game. Yeah, like we said before in the pregame, Suffolk Community College, they were just looking to keep the game close because that's really what Nassau is trying to do. They're trying to keep him below 65 points, and if Suffolk can keep it close the whole time, they'll make it interesting. But I think what I've really noticed in this game, too, so far to this point, is that Suffolk has played a very, very up-tempo game. Uh, first free throw is missed by Andre Harris, rebounded by number five, Terrell Williams, uh, who brings the ball up court, looking to find some pound on the pass to, finds Dana King, who then is ready to set up the play for the Lions. Uh, he's on the far side wing, finds Terrell Williams on the top of the three-point line, takes the shot, goes for the re- layup, double pumps, Misses it, but it's rebounded by Yancey Ulesi, who puts it in on the rebound. It is 14-12 Suffolk. Darius Townsend finds Andre Harris on the far side wing. Oh, wow, great pass back. Oh, back great to, block, though. To Darius Townsend, who then finds Lee's John, who's then blocked by Yusuf Young. So a great play there on defense to get over and make the play as it was developing and make sure they don't get the point scored on them. Lee's John finds... Number 13, Darius Townsend on the inbound, who then looks for Kevin Roberts. Double teamed, feeds it off to Joshua Cohen, who misses, rebounded by number 10, Charles Wingate. Brings the ball up, passes it to Tara Williams, looking to hand the ball off to Dana King. He receives it, looking for the pass back to Tara Williams. Not a lot of motion on here right on the play. Yeah, Nassau's looking very stagnant. And Dana King still finds a way to get up and under uh, for the layup. And they are still down. Uh, by 4.16-12. Darius Townsend has the ball, bringing it up, passes it to Kevin Roberts, who then sends it back to Andre Harris, who crosses through two Nassau defenders, passes it then to Joshua Cohen, who misses the uh, easy layout, but is rebounded by Yusuf Young, who then passes off to Terrell Williams for the ball up the court. Uh, he then passes to Charles Wingate for the three, and he hits it from downtown. Kevin Roberts brings the ball up, passes it to Andre Harris, who hits a three of his own to bring the score back to 19-15. Dana King brings the ball up court, passes it to Charles Wingate, who is looking near side wing, shooting back for his own three, and he misses back again. Rebounded, though, by number 32, Yusuf Young, who puts it up and gets fouled down low. So he will go to the line for a one-and-one. Yeah, that was great positioning right there by Yusuf Young. He definitely was able to get that rebound with ease right there and try and put it back up to get the M1. And he is not as he is the tallest player on the Lasso Lions team at 6'6", uh, using his size to his advantage. And that's what's going to help these Lions win uh, this game is using that size. There's nobody on the Sharks that are even two inches within him. So he has a definite height advantage. So we'll see if he continues to use that throughout the game. Uh, Yusuf Young at the line. His first shot is missed. So it's not a one and one it's, a, uh, it's going for two because they are in the bonus. The uh, substitution, number 23, Kamal Hart, come in, and Cody Montgomery, number 24, for Suffolk. And number 15, Kevin Chambers for NASA. Uh, Yusuf Young's second sh- shot from the free throw line goes in, so it is 